Hey everybody, this is Darla here and I am standing on my patio. It's Cinco de Mayo and they're cooking tacos downstairs, like cooking like mad. They're getting ready for a big party and I had a few minutes and I thought I would just shoot you a quick video. I've had a couple conversations lately of a topic that I thought would be really good for training. So the topic is, Darla, how do I build a network marketing business when I'm working all the time or when I've never done something like this before and I don't have the time. How did you do it? And I, and I explained this story and over and over again and, and it made me go, hmm, this is a really good training piece. So when I got started in my first network marketing company, I had no time. I was working in the salons. I was working seven days a week from sunup to sundown, the hardest days of my life. But I had a husband who was also working with me in the salon. And so when I got started in that business and we saw immediately that it was gonna work, that we were making paychecks, sorry, I have hair flying in my face, um, we sat down and we made a game plan. And we set a specific amount of time where Jim was gonna take over all the stress. He took over all the headaches so that I could have the time to build a network marketing business because we knew we needed to create the leverage. We needed to build this thing. And we knew it wasn't gonna pay us the money that we needed right out of the boat. And that's the thing that most people, when they get started in a network marketing business, they don't make a million dollars in their first three months, so they quit. <laughs> you know, they're like, oh my gosh, it's not working. And network marketing works like that because you have to build an iceberg. You know, an iceberg doesn't just evolve and appear overnight. An iceberg works under Underneath the surface before it even comes up on the top of the top of the water and builds up right the iceberg is bigger underneath than it is on top and so when you build a network marketing business you know it's no different than a traditional business I worked my butt off in my salons day in and day out for three years before I even made a penny a penny of profit a penny and like paid a ton of money and paid the price but nobody ever said to me, are you sure that thing's gonna work? Have you made any money at that thing yet? How much are you making now? But for some reason, people get into network marketing and they think it's okay to ask that. It just blows my mind. But in network marketing, you have to work really hard and make no money sometimes, very little money in the beginning, just like you do in a traditional business, okay? You gotta build your foundation, just like you do in a traditional business. You have to plant your seeds and you have to grow it. So in the beginning, it's work, 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 get paid. Work, 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 get paid. Work, 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 get paid. Work, work, get paid, work, get paid. Work, 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 get paid. Work, work, get paid, get paid. Work, work, get paid. And then you work, get paid, work, get paid, work, get paid, 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 get work, get paid. And that's why you build a network marketing business because you don't want to work for 40 years. You want to work for four. You want to compress 40 years into four years. But what happens is most people don't understand how to, how to actually structure the exit plan. So in our first business, Jim said, I'll take over all the stress. I'll work sun up to sun down in, in what we know is failing and you go build this thing. And so I went out and I built this thing. I did meetings every day. I went and talked to people all the time. I was still working a little bit too on the side, but I was building this thing, right? And then my paychecks started growing and growing and growing. And then once my paychecks got to a point where they were like, wait a minute, we're making more money here than we're making here. Why not do this more? Then you can do the flip and do the conversion, right? And so that's what we did. So I, Jim carried all the stress. He took care of all the bills. He took care of all of everything. I had nothing to do with it. I did, he gave me complete space to have mental clarity so that I could work and build a network, learn. I did a lot of uh, personal development, educating, going to courses, flying around and taking classes and seminars and listening to lots of audiobooks and reading lots of books every day so that I could educate my brain and reinvent myself and learn a new industry, right? Okay, so now fast forward eight years later, eight, nine years later. So that first company went away, we went to a second company and we did it again. Jim took over everything while I built the network and he did it again. And, and so now we're doing it again. And so Jim has a job, and you know, Jim's not worked jobs in a long time. So he's working a job and he's working that job to pay the bills. That's it, just to pay the bills. While I have the space and mental clarity to go build a network, right? And so 
once I started building my network, you know, he's making the money and then things shift, you know, then I start matching his income. And then once my income gets to a certain point, then he gets to again retire. So what if you don't have a spouse? That's the question that I get all the time. What if I don't have a partner, Darla? What if I don't have somebody that I can lean on? Then you lean on your job. You lean on your job. You know how to work a job. You've worked a job your whole life, right? Get another job if you have to. Go drive Uber Uber, or go do something that will pay you temporarily, that puts you around people so that you can let the job be your spouse. The job is gonna pay the bills while you build your network marketing business part-time. It may take you a little longer, but here's what I tell everyone. I want you to think about a 10-year plan, a 10-year plan. If it takes you 10 years to get to 20,000, not a lot, $20,000 a month, $15,000 a month, not a lot, in your network marketing business that you've been building part-time, if it took you 10 years, would it be worth it? A freaking course it would be worth it because you can't even do that working 40 years in your full-time job that you've been working forever and that everybody else on the planet works every day and never makes, right? That's what I don't get. But listen, this audio is not for that or this video is not for that. This lesson is for those of you that are trying to figure out how to make an exit plan. How do you become, how do you reinvent your life when you're consumed in working for a living, for a paycheck? How do you do it? You either have a spouse or a partner that you sit down and you make a game plan with. And the one that's the most educated, unfortunately, is the one that's gonna have to work because they can land the job. I can't land a job. As, as I can't, I'm a high, you strip me down and take everything away. I'm a high school dropout with no special skills. All I can do is cut hair and I can't even cut hair anymore because I'm handicapped to my trade. So really, what can I do? Nothing where jobs are meant for people with degrees and some smarts, so that's my husband. So Jim g goes and does that. But in the end, who gets to make more money? I do, because I'm not educated. I'm building a network, it's totally different. But that's how you do it, you guys. So I wanted to shoot this video to take away your excuses. I don't have a husband, I don't have time. Well, yes, you do, one or the other, just choose it. But my point is start building your backup plan now so that four years from now, when you get sick and break your leg and you can't work and you get cancer and you need to take care of yourself or when you fall in love and you wanna go travel the world because you met a guy that wants to whisk you away, you can because you have money that's coming into your bank account month after month after month after month that you worked for a while ago. It's like royalties, Elvis Presley, models, actors, book writers, screenplays. They worked for it once a long time ago and they get paid month after month after month on their royalties. Royalties and residual income are the same thing. Today, I still get paychecks from the last company that I was in from people that are drinking nutritional products and taking their vitamins every day. And I haven't sold a product or talked to anybody about that company in years, okay? That's called residual income. And so you wanna build residual income. Work for something once that pays you over and over and over again for a lifetime so you can live in beautiful places and do what you want every day and not set an alarm and raise your own children and not have to pay somebody else to raise your own children, be able to get sick and take care of yourself. And when your kids graduate from high school, you get to travel the world instead of have to work a job. Oh my God, I can't wait. Anyway, happy Cinco de Mayo, everyone. I hope that did something for you.